Hey, what's up, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Finest XI, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to complete the mechanic task gunsmith part eight with minimal effort. Let's get into it. All right, so for Gunsmith 8, Mechanic wants you to modify an AKM. He wants it all black, even down to the mag. So let's start with the mag. We need the 30 round P mag for the AK slash AKM Gen M3. It basically looks like this. So you need that one. It's available from Peacekeeper level three. Next, go over to the pistol grip. We got to put on the Zenit RK3. That is the classic AK pistol grip. Then we'll need to throw on the AKM slash AK74 PT lock. And we do this so we can throw on the PT classic of stock from Zenit. Next thing we need to do is come over to the dust cover and switch it out with the Bastion. Now, now it's going to tell you that you can't throw it on with the 6P1. That's this little uh, front sight right here. I'm sorry, rear sight actually. So just remove that. Then we can throw on the Bastion dust cover. Next, come over to the handguard. We need to switch it out with the CAA RS47 foregrip for the AKs. On the front of the gun, we need to throw on our old friend, the Hybrid 46. So we start with the DT mount and then we throw on the silencer again this is from peacekeeper that's the direct thread mount adapter and then the hybrid 46 multi-caliber silencer like usual on the bottom here we need to throw on the fortis shift tactical grip and i just realized over here on top of the bastion we were supposed to throw on the compact mount for sights that way we can put on the primary arms compact prism scope that should meet all the requirements to get you gunsmith part 8 done it's got the weight the ergonomics the sighting range and the recoil and as usual, I almost forgot to show you guys this list right here. I know y'all like seeing it and I know I like seeing it. So then all we need to do is head on over to mechanic and then turn it in. Congratulations, you are done with gunsmith part eight. Guys, I hope this video helped you out. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. And remember, I stream on Twitch all the time. So if you guys ever have any questions, I'm available over there to answer them for you. As always, have a wonderful day and I'll see you in the next one.